welcome back. Um, today I'm going to be making some steaks with um, items I already had in my fridge and pantry. So I already marinated the steaks for an hour. Um, this is like a balsamic Dijon marinated steak recipe. I guess you can put together that I use the balsamic vinegar that I thought was mine a few um, videos ago. And I also have Dijon mustard in my fridge that I also put on there, a garlic clove, soy sauce, Worcestershire sauce. Yeah, that's it. And the last 30 minutes is like room temperature because the recipe says like that's how you can like cook it better for like a uh, medium rare steak. Um, I did kind of buy cheaper steaks. I think technically they're called like rib roast, something like that. That's what I could read on the package, um, but that's okay. Basically, we need to cook it with a tablespoon of olive oil, and I bought three, three steaks. So I'll just add some olive oil on the pan. This is a very like vague recipe, so I'm just using the heat and everything by my own, and I'll cook three and a half minutes per side. Okay, steak number one. Again, Jameson again tonight. Ooh, that looks good. It seems like the soy sauce like burnt a little. So I think I just want to throw it out. And let's do it again. I think for some reason, I need to cover it with aluminum foil. <laughs> it's getting me. All right, very carefully, time to flip. Oops. to flip. Ah, ah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna give the first one a try. Woo! Like, it is so juicy. Actually, I just realized this is the second one and not the first one. Mmm! Right. It's cooked. It tastes really good. Um, kind of sweet. I'm guessing that's the soy sauce. Yeah, maybe I'm also tasting mustard too because it's kind of like sour y, but maybe that's the balsamic vinegar. I don't know, whatever it is, it's good. And this is my lunch for tomorrow. So thanks everyone for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!